guys. It's your boy Lightning McMurphy. Uh, I'm here today just to chat about the Smash Direct and my opinion on it. And I'm pissed. Honestly, I'm pissed. Like, there's nothing else I can say about it. There's no other words I could use. I'm just irate at this point. Like, another Fire Emblem character, that's eight. Almost tripling the Kirby representation right there. Eight characters. Seven of eight. All eight of them use a sword at some point in the match. Robin's a little different. I'll give her that. This new character, the, the worst part. I'm sorry I'm ranting. It just, it just feels right. I needed to say this. But the new character, the worst part, seems fun. Seems cool. Got a lot of weapons. He's got a spear. You know, Bandana Wadi has a spear. Could have put him, whatever. You know, he's got a lot of weapons, though. He's got, you know, he can cancel his projectile. That looks like it kills him full screen. That seems pretty broken. I'm going to try that. Probably put that in a combo video or two. But, like, at the end of the day, it had to be a Fire Emblem character. Another one. And not only that, but it's just promoting another new game. Like, every character before it did. Like, Martha and Roy did. Like, Ike did. Like, Corrin did. Like, this one currently, Byleth is doing. I'm just at a loss for words. It doesn't make sense to me. What is Sakurai's obsession with this game? I don't get it. He didn't make it. He made Kirby. We still don't get no Bandana Waddle Dee. There's been like 10 games since the last Kirby representation was first introduced. Like if you start with Meta Knight, like from then. I still see no Kirby reps. Kirby sold, what is it? I just looked up the stats earlier. Kirby sold over... 30 million units all time and Fire Emblem has sold 15 million so it's doubled Fire Emblem's output for what it's done for the company and yet it still has a third of the representation essentially and there's so many other cool characters too like we didn't just need Bandana Waddle Dee like how are you going to hype up for four characters four fire characters we won't count Plant you know like that was for free but you had Joker from Persona who is sick you have who was after that then you have Hero from Dragon Quest, literally one of the most legendary franchises of all time. Then we have after that is Banjo-Kazooie. Are you serious? Are you serious? This is the only Western representative we have. They gave it to us. He's like 30 years old, but we'll take it, I guess. And then the last one is Terry, who's pretty popular in Mexico as well as Japan, but still a hype character, don't get me wrong. So you got these four third-party characters. And then you follow it up with this first party character to represent a game that isn't even out yet for a character nobody really knows anything about. It's so, it's just whack. At the end of the day, it's whack. This, this is all I can say about it. There's literally nothing else I can say. We could have had Doom Guy, Master Chief, Dante. Could have even had first party wise Gino, Bandana, Waddle Dee, Crystal from Star Fox. You know, there's not another Star Fox rap. There hasn't been God knows how many games. We could have had Trixie Kong or Dixie Kong. We could have had Funky Kong. We could have had all these people. And then people want to complain about Mario and Pokemon having more representatives. Like, they're not the two most recognizable IPs of all time. It, it drives me crazy. I don't know what to say.